in the news lately, it has been reported that Creflo Dollar will get his $65 million luxury jet. After some controversy surrounding his plea for donations from his congregation for a Gulfstream G650 jet about five months ago, World Changers International, which also operates as Creflo Dollar Ministries, has announced it is ready to purchase the plane. It said, a long-range, high-speed, intercontinental jet aircraft is a tool that is necessary in order to fulfill the mission of the ministry. That's funny. I don't remember Jesus needing a high-speed jet or anything comparable in his day and age to preach the gospel. He walked everywhere he went. And it's not like Creflo Dollar is the only pastor with the truth of the gospel and he needs a jet to travel around the world as fast as possible because people are dying to hear his message. As a matter of fact, he doesn't even preach the true gospel of Jesus Christ. He preaches the prosperity gospel. What that promise is, is that you will become rich monetarily and spiritually if you tithe to his church. However, that is contrary to the words of Jesus in Matthew chapter 6, verses 19 through 21, which read, Do not store up for yourselves treasures on earth, where moths and vermin destroy, and where thieves break in and steal. But store up for yourselves treasures in heaven, where moths and vermin do not destroy, and where thieves do not break in and steal. For where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. The $65 million in donations Creflo Dollars Ministry gathered for his jet could have went to a better cause. It could have been used in better ways in order to finance the spread of the gospel. At the least, it could have been used to train an army of preachers which could go around the world and preach the gospel 100 times faster than he can do alone. As a matter of fact, that's what the Bible tells us to do. The Apostle Paul wrote these words to Timothy. And the things you have heard me say in the presence of many witnesses, entrust to reliable people who will also be qualified to teach others. Then you have basic necessities of people in third world countries which need food, water, and health care. In my opinion, Creflo Dollar taking up donations from his congregation for a $65 million jet is just plain selfish. The man already has two Rolls Royces and two homes with a value of two and a half million dollars each. There's no reason why he could not fly commercially. That would enable him to use his donations in a more efficient way to train preachers to preach God's word and help others in need. But then, of course, he would have to compromise his lifestyle. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and share it. Also, check out some of my past videos on my channel page. I have a lot of good Christian videos there, which I'm sure you'll enjoy if you liked this one. God bless.